Yo! I'm here today to talk to you about goals. How many of you set goals? Um, it's a perfect time now. It's Christmas, coming into the new year. You have to take some risks when you set these goals, but if you haven't done it before, I recommend you try it. Um, I'll help you. I'll talk you through it. I've set goals now for three years and they help me to maintain focus, um, drive throughout the year, st still be motivated at the end of the year, uh, like now, still striving for that yearly mileage or whatever it is. And I guess the biggest takeaway from it is that you should think in one year, where do you want to be? Do you want to be the person who says, I'm a year clean or uh, from meat or whatever? Um, my life has changed in whatever way for the better. Um, uh, uh, and, you know, ask yourself when setting these goals, where were you one year ago? Um, how has your life changed since a year ago without goals? Um, and if you can answer those questions positively, then now is the time to set those goals. Um, be smart with them. How will you reach them? What will you do? Don't set a goal saying, I want to, hi guys. Don't set a goal saying, I want to have more fun. What does that mean? You want to have more fun? What What are you going to do to have more fun? You're going to start going swimming. You're going to go to the cinema every weekend. Like, don't just have more fun. Say, I'm going to do this. And this is going to result in me having fun. So be specific with them um, and, and work out how you're going to reach them. If we relate it to running, you're going to do 1,500 miles in a year. How are you going to do that? Don't just say you're going to do it. How are you going to do that? Are you going to do 100 and whatever a month? Are you going to try and maintain that? So work it out. Make them achievable. Make them specific. Uh, if you visit my page, you will see the goals I've set. I've set them every year. You can go back. You can scroll through. You can see the goals I've set every time. They're, they're achievable. They're realistic. But they're not easy. And I often don't hit them. Sometimes I miss out. You know, I wanted to do London Marathon in three and a half hours, I did it in 3.34, but that goal got me 3.34 instead of 3.40. I'm gonna go again, I'm gonna see if I can do Manchester in 3.30 um, again, and if I can, great, it's a goal that I'm gonna to set to try and achieve. So have a look, see if you can do it. And, and um, whatever you do, sorry about that, whatever you do, do not give me Oh, well, I better put something in there to fall back on. Because nobody should be falling back. You don't fall back on anything. Because if you just put something in there to fall back on, you're destined to fail. If you're going to fail at something, fail forward. Don't fall back. You want to fail and fall forward. Because that way you're going to see what you're going to hit. So fall forward, fail forward, learn from it. Do not set anything to fall back on. Uh, I'm going to finish up. I'm going to have to read this off here because it's a story I've just heard. Um, essentially, dreams without goals are just dreams, and we get that. Um, so your dreams, whatever dreams they are, to run London, to to do a 3.30 marathon in my case, to run 1,500 miles, to do my first Ironman. Uh, these are all dreams, but without goals and without setting targets to do them, then you... Um, potentially will never so set the goals um yeah to finish up one guy's goal i've read about was to eat a bicycle a metal aluminium whatever bicycle it took him 17 days and he cut it up and melted it down and made it into bite-sized chunks and he ate a bite-sized chunk every day um i don't know if he threw up at any point i'm sure he probably did uh, but the takeaway is no matter how big your goal is, if it's to eat a bicycle, and that's crazy, with desire and perseverance, you can do anything. You can eat a bicycle. All he did was make it manageable. He melted it down, bite-sized chunks, and he ate a bike. It's a true story. You can Google it. You can see it. it took him 17 days. Probably wasn't a great idea, but that was his goal, and I guess it was some kind of world record, maybe. Uh, and he did it and he achieved it. So set your goals, set them smart. If you want to talk to me, reach out, ask me about them. I can help you. I enjoy doing this stuff. 
I set them for myself. I see other people out there setting them as well. And I am inspired by you guys setting your goals. So um, this has been the longest video I've done for a, a long time. So hopefully you enjoyed it. Hopefully it made sense. Fitting behind me is the success iceberg. Success at the top. And then everything you get. Success is the stuff underneath the water that you don't see. But they all lead to here, to the success. So set your goals, set them smart, check my goals out, see what you think and keep going at it. Got a big year 2022.